Today we're going to show you the easy way to program the garage door opener on the C8 Corvette. So let's get started in this video. So thanks for tuning in guys. So like I said, we're going to be programming the built-in garage door opener on the C8 Corvette instead of basically using this. Now this is going to be the easy way to do it where you're not having to get up on the ladder and try to program this thing by hitting the learn button and all that kind of crap. And really all you need is your C8, this right here, and then you just have to be home because this has to cut and like communicate with the actual main unit. Um, and all gets done in 30 seconds. So this is gonna be a quick, easy video. So let's just get into it. So alrighty guys, so we're sitting inside the C8 right now. You have your garage door opener built in. If you have that option on the C8 Corvette, it's right here. And in general, if you have a new car or whatnot, these will be ready basically to program right away. But if you happen to have moved like I just did recently moving into this new house, you're gonna have to reprogram these. So that you have to reprogram it basically to factory settings. In order to do that, it's very simple. All you have to do is just press the left and right hand button simultaneously and hold it down. And the big important thing here is to look at this little red light here. The moment it goes from solid and essentially changes to a fast blinking, it should be basically factory reset. So, okay, so it's factory reset right now so we can release here. And what this does is it basically sets it up that all of these are ready for programming. When it's ready for programming, you're gonna see the light here basically do a slow blink. All of these basically have, yes, slow blink here. So what that means is that each of these is, has an, is an open slot. So the factory reset is only something that you should have to only do once and then depending on whatever you program, once it's programmed in, that slot is now taken. The others will still always be ready for programming whenever you get a chance to or if you have a second house that you need to re need to program a second garage door opener or whatever these will be available um, whichever ones you choose you can choose any of these so i have my main garage door opener that i'll reprogram and it's actually really really simple to do all you have to do is just hold this button down while it's blinking and then you're gonna hold the garage door button that you have down until it programs the actual garage door. So let's go ahead and do that. And you see how it's now fast blinking how it is? That means that it's actually taken the actual call, like actual uh, signal program, so it's, a, it's now marked. So all you have to do from there is now, is basically set. So now I just opened up the garage door again to kind of, you know, show that it actually worked. And like I said, so you see that this one is now programmed but these are all, the left and right are still slow blinking because they're still available open slots that you can then program if you have a separate door and stuff like that. So it's really as simple as that. So really, really easy. Don't have to get up in the ladder to actually do the programming. Now, that being said, I'm going to put a little caveat to that. This process works with Chamberlain for sure in regards to that garage lift door opener um, brand. I am I am not 100% sure it works for other brands like I have my LiftMaster in the second bay. I tried to program it this way and it was giving some kind of issues which means that it probably needs to go through the learning code um, process. So that's something to keep in mind that depending on the brand, this should work on most cases but there might be cases where you might have to actually use the learn button function which is... Yeah, it's a pain, but it is just what it is. But at least in this regards, you don't have to get up in a ladder and do that. Very quick and easy, under 30 seconds um, kind of deal, and you have your garage door set, so you can see. So if you have any questions, feel free to put it in the comments below, and also check out any of my other videos, and we'll see you next time. Take care, guys.